behind this, I there's a there's a blue wall and over there is a green screen. So we have options. Um my agent sent me the email telling me that I should audition for this. And like the moment I read the script, I knew that it was just such an important story and an amazing, it was just an, it was going to be an amazing experience. I was like, like, I always put a lot of work into my auditions, but I put a little extra energy out there because I was like, I really like this one. And, um, I, I felt really good about it. And we sent it in and I got callback after callback after callback. I had so many, it took a month. Like it was, it was, it was wild. Um, there were a lot of callbacks, but when they finally told me I got the part, I was just, I was just so happy. It was, it was, it was, it, that whole day was kind of a blur. Okay, so I was in this room. I was just over there because behind this, I there's a there's a blue wall, and over there is a green screen. So we have options. Um, but I was I was standing over there in on Zoom, and uh, Tim Federley, the incredible director, he actually was recording it. So he has a recording somewhere of when he told me I got the part, um, and it was just it was just it was just amazing. Yeah, I remember. And then. He, he got me like a huge tree of balloons and he timed it. So he's so good like this. He timed it perfectly so that when I walked out of the room, they were delivered to the house. Like, right. It was, it was the most mind blowing magical experience ever. I'm, I was really honored to be telling the story of of Nate and which is also the story of Tim because it's it's kind of like autobiographical and um it was just such an important story to be told and I I was it was just an amazing experience and I'm honored to be able to be that voice yes so me and Aria were in the same hotel and we were on the same floor a couple of times. So we, we were always hanging out. We were, we were so close. Um, but we also had brunch with like Tim and Josh, um, a couple of times and everybody on set was just so, so incredible to work with. Like Josh, Aria, Tim, Lisa, like all of the cast, all of the crew, it couldn't have been a more perfect experience. Yes, we do. We text all the time. Um, she called me like a couple days before the premiere just to talk about how exciting it was. Um, and yeah, we are, we're super close and I love her dearly. Yes, we did. We were exploring all the time. Um, we, we walked around New York city. We went to some crystal shops cause we're both into like healing crystals and stuff like that. Um, but we, we we walked we walked around Central Park a bunch of times. So I I think I think that was one of the my favorite moments. I I do I do miss performing live. But like you were saying, it being able to be in a movie that's about Broadway was just so amazing. Because I'm a I'm a theater kid. That's that's where my heart is. And um so tour. I was on I was on tour for a year and a half and um we were always traveling around. I got so close with so much of the cast. Like those were some of the best memories of my entire life just being tra traveling around and going to the different theaters. And um it was it was really amazing because I got to go to so many incredible places around the country. Like I I love to travel, so it was it was really a dream come true. And um, the show, the show's just amazing. So, that's an awesome question. Um, I I love I love answering this question because they're they're so they're so different, um, but they also have a lot of similarities. Because when you're on stage, you're 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 like really big and like extravagant and you have this live audience to feed off of and if something messes up then you just got to keep going but when you're in film like it, it's so much more 
personal and, and it's like a lot more subtle and you can do it as many times as you want to make sure you get that perfect emotion, that perfect line, that perfect movement. Um, so they're different, but it, it's, they're both amazing. This is a really great story, actually. So me and Aria were, were filming in a high school. We were standing on the stage of the auditorium and, um, oh my gosh, I'm getting emotional just thinking about it. Um, and, and we, we threw this confetti into the audience and then Tim was like, all right, guys, that was the last shot. That's a wrap. And we just turned to each other and we were just like crying. We, we stood on that stage and we just like, were hugging and crying for like 10 minutes. It was, it was, it was so sad. But at the same time, we knew it wasn't over. So, but it was, it was, it was amazing. <laughs>